Hi there, I'm Anna Martin from Germany. I'm an artist and I work uh, in my home profession uh, as an sculptress. I don't know if it's a real word for it. You know, I work with glass and I'm making sculptures of it in some kind of installations. Hello, uh, my name is Grace Aysen. I'm an artist and I work in glass, mostly in stained glass, and I also do some restoration work. But my name is Teresa, Teresa Almeida, and I'm from Portugal. Uh, actually, at the moment, I am a professor in the Faculty of Fine Arts, uh, where I teach glass. I also do work with the kiln casting technique, like casting in pâte verre, but lately I'm coming back to the architecture glass and I just finishing a um, stained glass piece that is in the Portuguese Glass Museum. I hope you can visit one day, it's important. Hello, my name is Lizzy Lang. I'm from the Peruvian Forest and I got trained there as a glass blower. Since then I work with uh, glass, mainly with soft glass. My name is Colette Langen and I'm here at the residency in uh, Glass Mallory Peters, organised by the Craft Hub. I am absolutely thrilled to have been selected to come here. It's been an amazing experience. It's been wonderful working here, meeting people at the studio and the Peters family. And it's also been wonderful working with their staff who have been so helpful, so kind and so patient with us. We are the last day now, so we can see some stuff what we tried out. First we made a lot of samples in different techniques and got to know all what's possible here. And here uh, in Craft Hub I try to um, develop more skills with flat class. For my Craft Hub residency I really wanted to learn about how to do um, airbrushing and sandblasting. We did, I did a sample for my own piece of work using lace and glue and I was, I was very happy with that result. So I really wanted to learn about airbrushing because I want to see its potential in future work, especially in larger scale work. Um, so I worked with in, uh, Judith in the airbrushing studio at Peter's, which was amazing, I really love it, um, to try to um, achieve gradations of colour from very light to dark, line work. And now I make like a translation into the class which is flat and I try this once with three glass blades and also one time with trying to put this all together in one plate to show the difference in between when you use it like one or two or three layers because of the layers there will be something like parallaxes and it will change when you move and it's again a little bit more like an object and when it's just in one plate it will be like really like a picture. Fun with sandblasting, which I had also never done before. So this is um, the kind of um, effect and imagery I wanted here in my drawing, and I wanted to work with layers of glass. So, as I said before, this is the sandblasted piece, um, and then this is the airbrush piece, and then I wanted to add a, a flash of colour, which is this lovely, vibrant orange yellow. So it will be like that. So I'm really happy with this effect and I want to explore it even more um, with the work that I do and the potential of using this technique, which is mind-blowing. I work here in the glass mill of Peters with this um, picture with the bubbles and I did a screen print with the etching paste and sand plastic, basically on a dichroic. Uh, glass sheet uh, on a mirror and on a float glass. 
I'm really happy to see these different effects and results, what I can achieve, especially the etching page, the paste was something new for me. And I really hope that I can do something like this again. Being here at Peter's studio, it's really like a dream come true. Uh, I heard about these uh, students of Germany for a long time, from my professor that came to visit here in the 80s. So being here and able to see all the glass they have, you know, the huge conditions, the huge kilns, the big facilities, it's... Uh, I don't have words to say how much I would like to thank you for this opportunity to be here and be able to experiment a lot of techniques that are related to the work I'm doing, like this samples here that I hope they will become good samples for the library, you know, the digital library. But I don't know, I, I really hope that I can come again in the future. And this is just the beginning of a good friendship, like it says in the movie. Thank you.